guys that, you know, you extended it out and won the game there. You were hotter than a pistol. That's what I was saying. What, uh, what did, did, was going well for you and the team at that? You remember that juncture I'm mm -hmm. talking about? Yes, sir. Uh, I mean, I think, believe, the, the, what really started was we got a string of stops, you know, like, we got three, four stops in a row. And that's what we, that's what we came out of the uh, huddle before the second half and was talking about how if we get stops, I believe we'll get a run. So that's really what it was. We got some stops. And when we got in the stops, our defense turned to offense. And you hit some shots. I mean, you, yeah. you had struggled a little bit earlier. Very, I know you had a couple good bad. looks that you missed. Yeah, yes, But sir. then you got, you know, it, it seemed to flow. Could mm -hmm. you feel it coming there? Yes, sir. I mean, I was able to I was able to see some shots fall. I mean, I couldn't get a bucket at all in the, game, in the beginning of the game. For the whole first half, I struggled. And I mean, I still struggled some, I believe, in the second half. But I was able to get a, a few buckets to go in. But really, we just focused on our defense, and I felt that using that energy off the defense, regardless if it's like getting stops and steals, but like even if it's not steals for me, just the energy to, on defense to get us to play well on offense. This team has a lot of confidence offensively. What do you, in this early part of the season, what are you trying to find out defensively, rebounding? What do you need to see there? Uh, I'm sorry, what do you, what do you mean? You guys have a lot of confidence yeah. offensively, so what, what needs to get better, I guess, off defensively? Oh, just, just containing the ball, containing the dribble and things like that. I mean, just the details part of it. I mean, that's really it. I mean. We see our man, we stay in front of our man, but the details, all pick and rolls and you know, hedges and things like that, that's what really what we need to focus on. They kind of hung around there in the first half a little bit with offensive rebounds. What does everybody have to do to kind of clean that up a little bit? Uh, just box out. What about in terms of Dakota? It seemed like a couple times you pulled aside some of the younger guys, kind of mm -hmm. educate them, stuff like that. Is yeah. it something you saw when you were younger that he would Absolutely. do for you? And you know, what's the value of that? With yeah, team? I value the seniors a lot in Dakota and as well. I mean, they're patient. They're patient with the guys here, and they were patient with me last year, and that's that's one thing that I realized. I mean, they pull you aside, and they'll tell you. I mean, even if you, even if it's late after it happens, at least they're gonna tell you, and they're patient about it. So that's one thing that helps a lot, especially throughout the game. Especially that's why it's good to have these games early, like in Taiwan as well. I mean, just be able to have their seniors around when they see the mistakes and kind of help them before they they make them if they won't make them again. How much do you think the team has developed over the course of time from uh, the university games to now? Well, I feel like we developed a lot. I mean, we put some more sets in offensively and things like that, but we're still just working. We still have a lot of work to do defensively and things like that. What did you see from some of the new young guys? Uh, I mean, Joe, Joe's a really good point guard. I believe he can handle the ball well. And he, had, he brought a lot of energy on defense as well. And, I mean, Matt played really well. Matt offensively and defensively protecting the rim. It has a mid-range shot. It looked really good. So, I mean, that's one thing. And then we got energy from Aaron and Eden, even in those last couple minutes. But you can get used to that. They, they bring a lot of energy to the team. Put some time this summer in your Euro stuff. Uh, <laughs> You're pretty confident with it. Yeah, a little bit. I've just been working on it. I mean, just say it work this time. That's not that's something you've always had, right? That's something you picked uh, up in with yeah, the 19s. Yeah, that's something I've been at. My pops, my pops talked me out. I got you. <laughs> Uh, you being a Texas native, how did it feel to see all of these fans come out to support the Hurricane Relief? Yeah, it was it was a this was all a good thing, a good thing to see. I mean, it was a blessing to be able to play in this and be able to raise money for this and everything like that. So just seeing everybody come together for it and for a good cause, it was good to see. Well, just out of curiosity, I mean, has it? Have you known people? Have you seen people or talked to people who've been impacted by it all? Yeah, yes, sir. I've seen. I mean, I went home like, like October fourth or first weekend of October and just seeing the damage and just seeing like rivalry high schools I played against shut down and kids having to move schools just because of it. Just cause of it. And I mean, I know a couple of friends of mine that, that had to evacuate their homes because of flooding and had to stay on the second floor for multiple days in a row and things like that. So I mean, just this whole this whole setup here, just being able to raise money for instances like that, you know what I'm saying? This was, this was all good. What's that like? I mean, you said you go to a rival high school. You may have hated those guys in high school, but to see what they're going through now. Oh, uh, I mean, it's. I mean, even if I mean, I really wasn't a big rivalry guy. I mean, like I was hating school or anything. But just even though they may compete against them, like it's never that serious. You see, what I'm saying. So like seeing something like that and then losing things and losing their homes and stuff like that is, is sad to see.